All right, chat. We're going to have a talk. There is some big stuff coming to Foundation in 2022. The uh, game's been updated pretty frequently ever since it kind of uh, was released in more uh, like serious form in 2019. And now in 2022, the devs are promising some pretty big things that I never expected to see in the game. If you like city builder games, this is definitely one for you. And this one allows you to build a kingdom in a uh, wonderful little... Uh, I guess like a collect, I don't know, it's a resource game basically, and it's a lot of fun to do. Um, so they've been, they've added some new features since the last time we played, and in 2022 it looks like they're going to be adding a lot of new stuff, including uh, a little bit more in terms of like uh, what you can do in the game. So there's going to be victory conditions, there's going to be estates that you can build, there's also going to uh, be prosperity here, so that basically you can work on... Uh, uh, working on splendor and making everybody happy in your city. There's also going to be a narrative, so there's going to be more of a story in the game. That's going to be cool. I, I would like to see that. A little bit more immersion while you build your city and whatnot. And a map generator! Finally, we're going to get more maps and stuff. That's one thing that was missing in this game. There's mods for it, but to be able to just actually set some parameters and do it like that, that's going to be cool. Plus new biomes, so not just the um, oak tree, pine tree, you know, like grassy hills anymore. It's now going to be like maybe deserts and maybe some um, jungles. Who knows? That'd be kind of cool. And then also more stuff on modding, which is cool too. But anyway, I thought that was cool to see a map generator. And then they're also going to redo how uh, residential works. So it says here, uh, villagers will still build up to uh, tier three level houses themselves, but through blood, sweat, and tears, they'll be better at it than ever. Which basically means that they acknowledge that it takes a while for citizens to build houses and stuff now, so that's pretty cool. And new onboarding, which I assume means that it's going to be easier for people to um, learn the game. Oh yeah, tutorials and such, in-game messages and such. So, this game started out pretty good, got even better, and is going to be great when it comes out uh, for the new 2022 preview. Or whatever, the, the update. Whatever they call the next version. 2.0, 5.0, 100.0. I don't know. Anyway, there was a recent update too on January 20th. Uh, that kind of makes some fixes and some changes and tweaks to things. And uh, I think last month we took a look at the version 1.8. Actually, no, this is 1.81. So even more stuff has been tweaked. Oh, yeah. Well, we'll go to the main menu and take a look at that. Oh, look at the building menu. That's nice. Very clean. All right. Well, anyway, uh, we're going to continue on with the city that we built a couple of months ago. And we're going to continue on version 1.81 uh, or 2, whatever this current version may be. So it's going to be cool. This is the game that you found me on and started watching. Good. Foundation's a heck of a lot of fun. So we're going to be enjoying that one today. And it looks like they're going to be adding more stuff. So that's really, really exciting. More um, updates, more stuff to build with. I'm excited for that. That's good. I always, I always like it now, the, the type of games that we get to play nowadays, where if you really like a city builder, um, they add more features, and then more and more features, and there's mods, and it's it's really cool. Like you, I've been playing games more than ever, because it's not the same thing every time. It's now expanded upon. Alright, version 1.8.1 uh, 1 is now available. There's a resource tracker that's new. Construction progress overhaul and many more tweaks. So hopefully it continues to uh, to benefit us. Let's check the um, quick save. Yay! All right, welcome back everybody to Foundation. Thanks again for smacking that join button to support the channel, unlocking more perks and such for yourselves, and of course getting access to all those lovely emotes. I believe we still have the king emote, so very nice. Feels good to be back in our village. We built. Actually, we built this in like about maybe three or four hours last time, um, which is rather small, but actually there's a, oh, there's a lot of detail to it, just for a, a one-off uh, time that we built our little, uh, oh yeah, we built our little watchtower here, and from that position you can see over the entire valley, look at that, you'll be able to see everything from here. Beautiful village, I agree. The uh, game, even in vanilla, is just absolutely gorgeous, and every time they add new stuff, of course, mods are even add to that beauty even more. Oh, it looks like we got new resource. I don't, I don't know what's new here. Oh, new, oh, new villager uh, from four people. One decided to stay. Okay, cool. Oh, we have new land down here. New extraction. 
I gotta kind of remember what we were up to. I know we were generating wood and cutting it down again. Housing is insufficient. Okay. Let's make sure everybody has a place to live. I guess we could buy some more houses here. Or new land here. Oh, we're also negative coins. Uh-oh. Okay, I don't, I don't remember. We're going to have to catch up. Yeah, this game's very organic. All the paths and stuff are made by people trying to walk like they do in Austria. So these, these roads were made by people just walking on them. And you can control where they walk by using forbidden land. So if you want people to use a gate or a specific walkway. Like here, I don't want my people walking through the trees. I want them walking through right there. So they do. Pretty cool. Yo! Sensi, thank you very much for the four months as a raptor ultimate. Yeah! Love me some foundation. Same. Hooked after watching you previously, you have got me addicted to end zone. All glory to Raptoria. Dude, I gotta play through end zone again, too. It's been a while since I've done, like, a playthrough series on the channel, because I really, really, really like live streaming with you guys. But it would be nice to do, like, another little video series. However, I know games like Foundation and stuff are... A lot of it is just kind of waiting around for things to get done, but that's the fun part. Is, like, asking for buildings to be constructed like this, and then waiting for your people to come over and actually do this stuff, you know? So, I don't know. I would like to go back to making some big O videos again, though. Wow, look at that. They're building a mine there. Oh, we're building an iron mine. Oh, so that's what we're getting ready to do. We're assembling a, uh, a construction site for mines. Oh, yeah. We were going to do... Uh, we're making uh, charcoal... Sm we're going to make uh, charcoal burners over here. And then we're going to start making iron ore. Yeah, that's going to be good. What's this negative 61? Oh, there's all this new stuff that... They, they must have changed the game slightly. Okay. Oh, this is... I don't remember any of this stuff. Cool. Damn, that's fresh and new. What's up, Kurt? Yeah, I know you guys... Every year I do, like, a, a, a foundation playthrough. And I noticed it's usually in the spring, so... Consider this a little extra bonus. And then when we go to, uh, when we get into, like, March, April, May, I think I'm gonna, I think that's when they'll come out with the, the new next big update. So we'll cover it then in, in a new, like, um, maybe four to six part series or something like that. There's not too much to cover in this game that we haven't seen before, but it's always nice to, like, go through the progression of building a town and then, um, especially getting to the monastery. The monastery is, like, the big thing to build. The military base and the monastery. Can you go first person in this game? I don't think so, but you can zoom in pretty close and pretty much see everybody at the first person level. Oh my god. People blink now! They blink! Poglad! Pog, pog, poglad! Po, poglad! They blink! Don't blink, Chad, or you'll miss it. Hi! Wow, they do more than just stand there now. That's awesome. That's got to be new. Wow. Pog lad emote. Oh, looks like we're earning money again. That's good. Let's see. We got to train some soldiers, too. I wonder what they'll have planned for new military stuff, too. There's kind of some military stuff where, like, you can go out on quests with a military, but... Five unemployed. Okay. Happiness is at 75%. We need to provide more goods. Okay.
I wonder, how do I assign them jobs? They've moved everything around from where it used to be. Common clothes we got a lot of. Are there any new materials? Wow, they've done a good job of making this look nice. You're eating uh, Pringles with Wendy's spicy fl uh, chicken flavor? Really? Wow. A hero has entered our realm. Welcome. Oh, these buildings look fresh and new. I don't remember these looking like that. Nice. The mill kind of looked like it that, but it looks different a little bit. Brewery, hop farm, nice. And then, of course, we can sort by whatever. Okay, we have six unemployed. How do I work on, like, employment? Let's see. Let's see. Building. First territory. Oh, assigning workers. Here we go. There we go. Okay, I see. Ooh, transport. Okay, nobody's unemployed anymore. That's good. Bum, bum, bum. Is it foundation? Well, the title does say we're building the most powerful kingdom with a medieval army. And then it goes on to say new foundation kingdom builder version 1.8. So if you read the title in its entirety, it will clue you in on what we're doing and what the name of the game is and what version it is. There's only so many words that'll fit in the title, though. Yes, we have happy little workers, don't we? Oh, it looks like we can do extraction down here. What is this um, light blue area? Oh, it's because we're regrowing and we're cutting things down. So the forestry building is cutting and also growing trees from the forestry building. Okay. All right, well, now we have to tackle a new task down here. we got to figure out how to do iron ore and stuff. Look at how cool the iron mine looks. Wow, they had to build... Look at that. We, like, ran out of ladder. Somebody's... You're going to have to jump on two people's shoulders just to get to the ladder to then climb up several thousand feet to go get to the iron ore. My goodness. All right, we need more people in the city. I would like to buy another territory then. 
So that way we can have some more city... Um, we need some more homes over there. I can't believe no one's building a house here. It's like, that's the perfect spot. I, my favorite thing about this game is when city uh, buildings are kind of integrated with homes. Like, for example, we got some houses and stuff here, but then there's also, like, uh, you can, like, put tailors and stuff nearby, and it'll, it'll all blend together nicely. Sometimes things can get a little crowded, like the church of Pinto Blast, but can we name the church? No. That's nice. Maybe put a well there. Uh, we could. Let's take a look and see if there's any new decorations or anything. Oh, you can rename the church by clicking the feather? Okay. I'm learning all over again how to play. No, you can. Awesome. Fantastic. So does that count for everything? Yes, so we can rename every house in the game. See, this is what I want to be able to do in City Skylines. Games like Foundation and games like SimCity 2013 allowed you to uh, build, like, modules and expand things. So, like, for example, if our church was suddenly too small, we can, instead of deleting the whole church just to make it bigger or make a new one, you could just expand to the existing one. Mm. Yeah, the UI looks beautiful. They've done a fantastic job. I'm kind of tempted not to play this again, just so that way I can come back in like a couple months and then just do a fresh new series on it, because a lot of people uh, may miss out on all the stuff that's new from our last uh, coverage of it. It's great. It's a wonderful game. It's a game I really like. Okay, she's not blinking. I'm playable. All right, we need money for trade. I want to also do some more. Let's do some more decorations, see if we can get more people to build a house or something. Let's see. Oh, there it is. Trying to figure out how to rotate stuff. There we go. Who doesn't like tacos? That's crazy, people. That's crazy. Crazy talk. Iron deposit. Oh, we got nobody assigned, though. Ah, oh, Kingdom of Raptoria, Lord Raptor. Okay, so you can change all your names and stuff. Cool. I wonder if in the future with new biomes that means we'll have to worry about heating. If you go to somewhere cold or if there'll be weather where the people will then require more charcoal or something in the winter or during colder times. Turned out so good. I love it. Alright, how do I unlock new trade routes? 
let's see, army, estates. Actually, I think we're trading with everybody. Oh, there we go. Now we can trade with middle because we had twenty. Uh, we had fifty clothing. Perfect. So now we have another trade partner, and they will buy bread, tools, swords, and jewelry, and they'll sell iron, coal, wine. We could buy bread. They'll buy clothing. Clothing, selling them clothing would be really good. We're making clothes, so that would be a big benefit to us. But we need to buy 20 bread, so. Hmm, okay. Okay, now I gotta see how to, um... Hmm. How do I modify that? We wanna buy bread? We'll buy 20 so that way we can unlock the final trade route and then start selling clothing. That'll actually make us money. A lot of money, since we have sheep and such now. Now we're making clothing. Somewhere around here. Do I stream on Twitch? Sometimes. It's been a few years. Maybe one day. Hello, Valentin. How you doing? Yeah, the, the sheep are nice and round. Perfect for shearing. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll uh, wait until trade gives us enough money for... Buying a new territory for housing or for enough bread to unlock one of the next trade routes. That's going to be cool. What if we can adjust market prices? Let's see, where's the market again? Hmm. You have to click build for things to build. Um, things become a blueprint. Oh, yeah, there, there is a uh, confirmational button then, yeah. Everything you can build in a blueprint until you click build then, including individual buildings. I know you can. you have to confirm it for the larger buildings like military bases and monasteries and churches and things. Yeah, maybe we should start trading chili con carne. Yeah, that'd be a good thing. We actually have a ton of coal and iron. Now, if we can build a blacksmith, if we don't have one. All right, so that'll be the next thing to build. So let's make a blacksmith. Oh, and then we can start selling that iron.
Blueprint mode is nice. Yeah, we can sure make a profit with those sheeps. Nothing but sheer profit. Well, looks like we got a lot of food in the kingdom. But how does that do? Oh, we have 50 clothing again. Uh, let's set up a trade route for that. Trade all above 50. Can you see the castle? Well, it's not necessarily built. We kind of have a little keep over here on this left side, but it's nothing just yet. We're working on it. Gonna work on our economy and try to get more uh, imports and exports going through trade. Now, oh, did I buy that bread? Wow, we have a ton of wool. Make a sheer profit, will it be worth it? Yes. Wow, chat. Wow. Okay. Oh, buy if any of our below 20. Okay. We gotta buy bread if it's below 20, so let's buy 20 bread. Sell berries above 50. Yep, that works. Okay. All right, so now we should be able to import bread, unlock another trade route, and then start selling clothes, and then that'll be the money issue solved when we start exporting clothes. And then we'll buy the territory here, build some new homes, and then we'll have more people to work the jobs that just opened up over here. So we got a full circle. It'll be good. We just need to wait soon. Yep. People's eyes blink now. Major, they should have made a major update for that one. Like, major update. We made it so people can blink. Yep, there's a combat element to the game. Got to build some keeps and train some soldiers and send them out on quests with the king and his armies and bring back spoils of war and make weaponry and you can trade weapons and or export them or import them. What eye can blink? Well, a green eye, if you click or tap join and become a member today. That's right. Everybody here is eligible to become a member if you haven't already. Get custom emotes to use in the comments and live stream chat. And, of course, loyalty badges for how long you become a member. That's true. Don't blink, chat. You might miss the opportunity. Not to mention extra giveaways and such in the Discord for everybody. So make sure you join the Discord, too. Link's down below in the description. All right. Nine days, it looks like a military mission is going to be available. We got the... Uh, that guy coming. Um, the messenger or whatever. Bam, bam, bam. Ooh, Lord Man... Oh, right. We have a storage capacity, too. Base is 500 plus 8... Uh, 170 for the expansion of the Lord's Manor. I think every time we go out on a military mission, we also get money for that. Do we have any soldiers? 
Zero soldiers assigned. I'll try to get two troops, but we're going to need way more than that. And we're also going to need to do... Uh, we need weapons, I think. I, well, I think we make spears. I can't remember how it all works. I will learn again. Did we finally get the bread yet? All right, let's speed up to max speed. Hmm. Right, we need that bread to come on in. Name on the game. Read the dis uh, the title in its entirety. Can't make iron until we've got 200 coin. Oh, we can make tools. Oh, wait, then we need an iron smelter first. All right, so we got to build the metal smelter first, and then we should be able to uh, maybe export iron if we need to. Yep. Foundation started out really good, got even better. Now it's just phenomenal, and it seems like it's going to get even even better. It's just, a, it's just a lovely little, like, hey, just build a village and do trading and all that kind of thing. Yeah, there's lakes, rivers, and ponds in the game. On this map that we're playing on, there's not, but... They're going to change how the whole map system works in the future, and there'll be a map generator, so that way you can set the the game to have, like, um, if you want to have, like, a river or, or a big lake or a coastline, you can do that. Right now, it's like there's, I think, eight determined maps, but there also are modded maps. Like, the, the mod community made a ton of maps, so. But I wanted to uh, continue on from a kingdom that we had before, because this one was going really well, and I didn't want to just leave it alone. Nice. We got a pretty nice population chat. Nice. 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 Uh, the quests are to fight wars. Yeah, when the, when the king calls on you... If you have troops available, you can send them out. And you'll kind of share in the... In the booty if you win. Is there aging mechanic in the game? I'm not sure. I'd, I've only seen people come to the village so far, so I don't think there's either... There, I don't even think there's a birth mechanic yet, but maybe in the future. Like, it's like, if, if your kingdom is nice, people will come and people will stay, but I don't know if they have children or not. Okay, we need to get some more people working. Oh, we have troops ready. She's got nothing for a weapon. Well, right now, she's just reminding chat to, to like the stream. With that thumbs up like that. Alright, we're going to have to get weapons. That's for sure. I need money. Let's let's do some better trading. I don't know what anybody buys or whatnot, so I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm just gonna set it up as if everybody bought everything, although most of them don't. Let's just set it up. Fish, we don't have any water.
Okay, let's sell stone. Ah, oh, we don't have a farm yet either, but that's okay. Oh, we have five swords. Okay. Uh, let's see. I forget how we can assign our so. Oh, that's right. I think our soldiers don't carry weapons until you deploy them, and then you can give them weapons on their way out. Like, you can tell them what to carry. I don't know. How can you make honey? I think you need to make a monastery, and then you need to make an apiary, and then the monks will take care of the bees. They also make herbs, and uh, they work on growing grapes, and then you can use that to make wine if you have a cooper, which makes barrels. Now, I think you can serve the wine in the inn, I think, or trade it, which is probably worth a lot of good money. Well, would you look at that, a little Pinto blessing on the way to the castle. A little monk coming to give us a new quest. He's almost here. It's like waiting for an Amazon Prime delivery. <sighs> oh, finally he made his way through the church. He had to stop. Hey, what? Okay, there we go. Ah, uh, these are needy times. Oh, who should we help? We're going to help out the clergy. Deliver 50 planks to the clergy. Oh, that's all done. Uh, let's see. If we need to deliver 50 planks... How do I do that? Is there a quest log? Oh, that's how you give them weapon. Okay, we can go out on a... Military quest, then. We can only pick one, so I guess we'll take the top one. Prepare the troops! Extreme chance to succeed. Excellent. Alright, they'll go out on some training. Now, with the leftover troops, they can still train while they're here, and then if the uh, raid is successful, they can bring back more weapons than... Oh, actually, uh, the quest will give us more money, too, so that'll that'll solve our cash problem we've been having. Did we get that bread yet? Yeah. No, bu oh, buy. That's, that's why I wasn't getting any. No, wait, buy all above... Wait, what? Buy until inventory reaches 20. Yes, okay. Jesus. Alright, so I'm going to use the money we get from the quest to buy this territory, because we need to house people. So hopefully that'll give them a good place. We could also give housing in here, but I don't think it's really desirable land. I guess nobody wants to build their house within a fortress where nobody can attack them. It's more fun to build out here where fires and disease and invaders could 
Kill you in the night. That's way more fun. Isn't that right, chat? Yeah. Let's give it up for Unknown Death. Yeah. Dying anytime. All right, our troops are going out. Let's give them some Pinto Blast Smash like. One like equals one luck for the troops. They are on their way. The Raptorian troops have marched off the map in formation. They'll line up and head single file to the edge of the map. They are on their way. And hopefully we see success. And then we'll buy some more of those buildings. Did this make this area desirable? Oh, okay, you just click on that, perfect. And the quest for the clergy was completed, excellent. Uh, if I remember correctly, you can put well market stalls, you can make land more desirable. Yeah, I seem to have done that here. There should be a way to see desirability. Ah, oh, there it is. Yeah, like even even here I've authorized them to build homes, but they don't want to build houses there. Let's try to build up in the side of the mountain. Try to build some houses up there too. Damn, what a good, smooth running game. Yeah, I uh, applied to get into the new Settlers beta. Did, did anybody here get into the, the Settlers beta? Did you guys play that? Apparently it came out yesterday. Uh, or, no, the day before. Uh, all you had to do was go, if you go to, like, thesettlers.com or Ubisoft's, like, website, you can, like, uh, acquire, uh, request access to it. I requested access, but I didn't get in. Or at least not yet. We are victorious, but, my lord, your troops have been very helpful regarding the matter with the evil neighbors. That said, the matter seems to be far from being resolved. We need your support. Uh, let's see. Difficulty average. All right, let's go. We'll go on one more battle with the king, and then we'll come back and then uh, have our troops uh, re <coughs> retrain. Ah, yes, the troops have been deployed. You can play with a Ubisoft Plus sub. Oh, really? Okay. Gross. A lot of people were saying it was much different. I never played a Settlers game before, so I can only base it off what I've seen. And it looks kind of cool. It seems like it's more of an economic game than a military game, though you can make troops. We'll have to see. Do I have a character in this game? Uh, you don't get like to control a king or anything like that. You are just basically like... It's like how it is in City Skylines, where you just click on stuff and stuff gets built. Most games like this are kind of like that. Except for Stronghold. All right, once the troops get back, we have money. Let's see, who could we improve relations with? Well, the church wants more splendor. The church wants more splendor. You're still in the airport mood? Oh, yeah. Masters of Orion? I don't remember that one. Yeah, 
Yeah, your character in this game is the city, that's true. <laughs> Clean your stained glass windows, yeah. Now eventually you can build a church that does have stained glass windows. Alright, for now we're waiting for the quest to complete. Oh no, our troops were defeated, no. Our troops should bring back money though when they get back, I think. All right, more people in the town. Um, I'm going to give three more people training here. The rest of the soldiers will have to arrive home. Let's do that so we have a group of five. Oh, we did get a, a, a gem from our previous mission. Excellent. Our troops did bring back spoils. Bum, bum, bum. Hmm. Oh, what is all that? We got new military mission uh, coming. Okay, we got our troops ready to train again. Let's see if we can build some new stuff. I need to edit this. There it is. Okay, cool. Yeah, I don't think the uh, church stores gold, but the keep does. The Lord's Manor does. Maybe the... Actually, isn't there buildings for the wooden keep that will store it? You can kind of see what, what actually stores uh, gold. I think you get a base 500. Yeah, base 500 and then plus 870 for the Lord Manor. That's why we built a treasury tower here. Hmm. Wow, seven buildings have a full storage. I still haven't got my bread. Let's see, we want to buy 20 bread. Maybe we just don't have enough cash.
Uh-oh. Oh, really? If your troops are defeated, none of them come back? I thought some would come back. Impossible. Okay, so we need weapons now. Yeah, rip for the troops, unfortunately. I guess average was a dice roll, so we're going to have to make sure it's absolutely a guarantee, because to lose... Boy, to, to go on a quest of average acceptance and to lose everybody, that means you lose all of their training and all the weapons that they brought with them, too, and that, that sucks. But we can always send more troops, so in this case, let's get 10 ready to go. Let's send out 10 troops this time. We want to guarantee victories. Let's see. Oh, I forgot to click build. Well, if the uh, yeah, if the wounded come back, that's good. Hopefully, they come back soon. It's been taking a long time. Uh, weaponsmith would require money to make. It's one of the things that. We're focusing on uh, trying to get cash for trade for other things. We got a plan. We're working on it. We played this game many times before. It's all coming back to me now. We're good. We are good. It feels good. It feels good to be back. I wish this map just had a few little ponds or body of water, but I think this was one of the early ones. Where they didn't even have, like, lakes or anything figured out. And then we'll build the airport, yep. Come on, guys, we just need 62 more hours and we can build the airport. Yeah, that took a long time. We just played City Skylines. It took about five hours just to build the airport, mostly because it just took a crazy amount of money and uh, soil and stuff, so we just had to get more money for that. But City Skylines and this game are two games that shouldn't you, shouldn't take you 15 minutes, 20 minutes, two hours, or two days. Like it should, This should be a very, very long game where you just go for hours and hours and hours. And then you get bored, and then you start over and do it again. You love this game, me too. Yeah, we've been playing this game since, like, literally the beginning. It's been a great adventure to see them actually, like, improve how certain things look. Like, for example, the the mine and stuff. And Mining used to be much different. It would just be a hole in the ground. You'll never see that airport at this rate. Well, we built it. But uh, in this game, it's probably going to be a couple... Well, probably about a thousand years. Till we have a big old airport ready to go. Okay, so no more accepting quests for the king until we're ready. Oh, and they're building the new uh, training. Gems, swords, expensive stuff we'll put in here. So it can be defended. Oh yeah, marble. I think you can make a, uh, you can turn your builders into marble carvers and then I think you can sell it to or do something with it. Uh, I played the Settler's Beta's full of charm, but I didn't like the beta map at all. I did hear people, a couple people say that. Also, I heard there was a lot of stuff that they that there was a tutorial and then after the tutorial the game dumps you in and it doesn't explain a lot of stuff is what I heard a few people saying which is okay I guess if you're just doing a skirmish and you just goof around and die 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 until you no longer die 
Well, let's check jobs. We got a lot of workers here now, so let's make sure we got everybody assigned. Eh, or at least as many as we want. Settlers is missing too much? Okay. I'm gonna have to give that a try myself. I'll... I'm thinking about doing like a few more, uh, just doing more videos and such and just kind of like, just taking the first look at something in about a half hour and just kind of see how it makes me feel and then if I really like it, come back for a live stream. I could have did that for the uh, airport DLC for City Skylines. I was too excited to actually live stream it and experience it live with you guys, but another thing I could have done is had a video out for this morning and then streamed a little bit later. So that way people who don't have as much time get to know everything and everybody who wants to hang out gets a long time to hang out. That's what we like to do here. It's fun. All right, we need some more quests to come in. We're not going to war against any bears, chat. Yep, our chat's our chat's really nice. We got a lot of great people here. They're required by law to be nice. Well, thanks for being here. It's a little bit like City Skylines, too, where you're painting districts for people to live or... Uh, to regrow trees or whatever, you're, you're like giving orders. Let's see. We'll just leave those two trees there. Yo, Live 9 stream. Thank you very much for the two. What was the airline called in the end? Well, we haven't unlocked that yet, so we'll continue playing more City Skylines tomorrow. We gotta get to level three on our airport, and then we can, uh, then we can name it, so... We will, we will work for that tomorrow, now that we got a city built there. It was long, but we did it. We finally got our airport. Thanks very much, dude, for the two. Let's take a look. Wow. Silent little assassins over here. Okay, two more people deciding to join us. Oh, we're getting good money. 250. All right, money's coming in. We're profitable. thing where we 
Wait a minute. I'm just remembering this. How do we, um... How do we do that thing where we, like, upgrade people? Where we give them, like, a... A promotion from, like, serf to commoner or something like that? Is that at the manor's house? Hmm. Um. Unless they got rid of that. And maybe it's a different system. Every month it'll ask you to upgrade. Where's our calendar? Month 20, week 3. Oh, yeah. How do you always find good games of this category? I'm always searching for good games. They're hard to find. It's gotten easier because now I have... Uh, the channel's now a million subs, and so developers come to me all the time with all sorts of cool survival games and city builders and DLCs and updates. I mean, even... Um, Recently, Foundation sent me an email, and they were like, Hey, nerd, we really liked your uh, live stream. We got more updates coming this year, so like, you better really pay attention to us. And it's like, oh, okay. <sighs> Let's see. Oh yeah, we can uh, we can extend the military base to be different stuff too. Cool. Training dummy allows soldier training and healing. Oh, so when our troops come back from battle, how's this up to six soldiers? Okay, let's. How is two soldiers? Or two groups. So we can have up to 12. Cool. And we'll let that be our great hall. Already placed. Okay, so then we'll just make that more treasury. All right, well that's cool. So the military buildings also extend that. Awesome. Yeah, I guess the dummies are good for healing. Bum, bum, bum. Well, that's cool to know. Ah, promotion available. There it is. So now we can upgrade some people from... Sort by... Okay, so these are promote two commoners, promote two serfs. Extra revenue from their new needs. Okay. Well, their new needs would be comfort, which means a house, and a church. Okay. Actually, wait. I wanted to go back there. New member, welcome. If we can get happiness up, will that work? Oh, it works. McAfee, thank you very much for becoming a little raptor. Welcome aboard, members. 
fire up the engines. Go pick up our new members. Thank you very much for clicking the tab and join. Enjoy those new emotes. Bum, bum, bum. All right, well, we got a lot of good money there towards the end. That was nice. Market, wow, the market's making us 3,240. Upkeep is, uh oh. Upkeep is spendy. Thank you for all the streams. Thanks for watching. Very nice of you. No blacksmith? Well, we need money to build the building, so I can't authorize it without a lot more cash. But I'd rather uh, try to unlock territory down here to, for people to build houses first, because with we can generate funds by just keeping everybody happy. Okay, so we're going to have up to 12 soldiers, so let's go ahead and do that. Let's just do 10. For now. Bum, 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 bum. And it looks like the church needs a big O upgrade. It's about time. Or we could build another one. Yeah, we could build a nicer church somewhere else. Let's build another one. I wonder if a church increases the... Uh, Mr. Paul, thank you very much for the two. This is relaxing. Well, thanks for watching, man. Let's see if a church raises... Uh... Desirability. Ah, uh, just might. Now we could put, like, a nice little chapel over here. We'll do a we'll do a little church. Maybe we'll make it like a graveyard for our troops. The temple of the warriors. Warriors. game is so cool for the custom building too like this this is what you know city skylines and other games need is for you to be able to just plop things around very easily make your own little high school and you know give the player some requirements of what the building needs in order to function makes sense but let us do more Oh, there's a warehouse there that we need to make. Uh, it's a little crowded. Cannot build missing uh, mandatory parts. Hmm. 
I'm not even sure if I'm happy for that location. I want to build it there, but I'd rather them build houses there. Okay, never mind. I liked what it was, though. I liked what it looked like, but I want I want them to be able to build there. A monk requests an audience. Okay. Twenty-one, twenty, twenty-seven. Let's do kingdom. I should wait. the clergy. Alright, so that gives us influence. So next we'll do kingdom and then labor. Alright, did any of those wounded come back? No swords. Still don't have any bread. I can't believe how full the church is. We could also maybe expand the church. Church capacity plus 10. Yeah, maybe we'll put a building over here. Mandatory parts are missing and or upfront costs can't be paid. Hmm. What's the cost though? Stone tools and wood. Yeah, on the ups upgrade screen, before you upgrade people, it'll tell you what they require next. As we went over before we upgraded those people at the end of the month, it stated that they required service and that they required homes.
All right. Well, anyway, let's go ahead and uh, get bread assigned then. We can import that stuff. promotion available again. Commoners need good food and comfort. Oh, now we can build. That was strange. That should increase the capacity to 80. Alright, we're getting some good money. We should be able to build, uh, buy that other section there. Then we can build a church here. Let's watch the construction. Then we'll sit back and get to 500 coin, and then we'll see if we can go out on some more military quests. See if we can buy some more weapons. Weapons. Which, which trading partner sells us weapons? That would be... Davenport. And we need to unlock them with bread. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, those buildings will look great. Oh, I love how we build the... Uh, Exit at the lower side of the church, too. That's like the emergency exit, so we can reach um, OSHA standards. You know, Jesus wants to be compliant. He, too, is at the mercy of OSHA and the Homeowners Association. This looks similar to Ostrief. That is true. If you like Ostrief, you will like Foundation. And if you like Foundation, you will like Ostrief. Both these games play together very similarly in many ways and very differently in many ways. Ostrief, I'd say, is a little more... slower and a little bit more based on actual, like, basic survival. But this has a little little bit more to do than Aust in, in Aust than on... Austria, but Austria is a little bit more about farming and crop rotation. This is a little bit more about like just kind of building and uh, maintaining basic services and military stuff, so that's cool. Alright, so now we have an 80 capacity. And we just need one more uh, cross up there. These are like the drive through. Like if you don't have time to go in and sit down, you can just do the drive through prey. Real, real quick, you just skirp, pull up real quick. Okay, monks approaching the village. I 
Oh yeah, I guess another game similar to this is going medieval, yeah. Kind of. That one's a little more like, um... Almost like Minecraft a little bit, like where you, you can get... You can design a building piece by piece. And this you're kind of putting already existing parts together. But in that one, that's a cool one. Well, it looks like happiness is skyrocketing. Good. And it looks like money is coming in like crazy. Excellent. Did we get our bread? I don't have bread. We have a 400 capacity. Hmm. Oh, we have berries up, <coughs> up there. Well, we can try for the blacksmith and such now, but I need bread. I need bread to trade for that other... Does your Twitch channel not exist anymore? I haven't streamed on Twitch in uh, three years, four years. Well, I, yeah, I guess we could we could do our own farming. Yeah, I suppose. All right, well, let's do it ourselves then. I just wanted to quickly buy some to open up a trade route, but all right, I guess we got to do it the old-fashioned way. Actually working for it, I guess. Okay, game. You win this round. It's just we gotta build a lot of stuff to do that. That's pretty. All the parts get laid out there before they build it. My right, last thing would be the something called a a bakari. The hell is a bakari? I've never heard of that in my life before. I guess we'll build it over here because it's kind of close to the market and also there's water over here. And if they're not going to build, then I'm going to do it. I forget, there's a there's usually a... Where does the production chain in this get a little bit more backed up? Is it is it at the mill? I can't remember if it's in this game where they make a ton of wheat, but it's really hard to make flour like it takes a long time or if it's the other way around where it takes a very long time to make um where it takes a long time to make the uh the brood at the uh, bakari Oh, also, the reason we couldn't build a lot of that stuff before is we didn't have a lot of money. So now now money's coming in. Well, except we're broke since we spent everything. But that's more of an investment because then we'll be able to open up another trade route and actually sell bread back to the people. Ooh, the mill looks nice. Bum, bum. 
Oh, we could have three farmers. All right. New member, welcome. Ooh, look at that fertility. Coco Soul, thanks for the nine months as a raptor egg, dude. Thank you for your support. That might be too much, but hopefully enough. All right, next one. Nine months should hatch any day now. I I would hope so. You can always become a hatchling at any time. Or Raptor Plus. Raptor Ultimate. Raptor Egg. Whatever. It's cool. Oh, do you get a black sheep now if you spam the uh, spawn sheep button? I know it says funny text, but... I want to separate these two fields a little bit. Okay, let's see how that works out. All right, so we got people working at the farms, people working at the mill. Then we just got to wait for uh, the bakery. Uh, the Bakari. The Bakari needs to be uh, constructed. Yes, we're constructing the Bakari. Are they uh, growing crops yet? Eighty-six percent happiness. All right. Um, maybe we could put another, uh, Oh, you know what? We'll, we'll sell directly. We'll uh, do a little... We'll have the uh, baker sell right there. We'll have the baker sell directly from the, uh, the, the bakery. I mean, the bakker will sell directly from the bakery. bucks 
Chat, I need to borrow 50 gold for money. It's... It's expensive, I need 50. Actually, someone give me a dollar and I'll go play uh, fruit slots for an hour. And I'll come back and solve the debt crisis. Bum 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 bum. Bum 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 bum. Cherry berries. Oh, there we go. Now we got money. Yay. All right, lots of good stuff's being constructed. Hey, and there goes the farms. Check that out. I think we could make this one even bigger. Now oh, it looks cool, though. Actually, I should grow it down here, too. Yeah, I need about tree fitty. Yep. Now I'll build like a little fence to separate the two farms. That's so cool. I love that, man. I love how the farming works in this game so much. I, I hope we get more crops to farm in the future. Because farming wheat and making bread and stuff is so cool. It'd be nice to grow like, um... I don't know. Garden stuff, like carrots and stuff. Have a good carrot stew. Thank you, chat, for 408 likes. I hope we can get to 410 likes before the end of the night. That'd be so amazing. Probably not going to happen. It's a monumental... It's basically like trying to build a colony on the moon right now, but it'd be pretty amazing if chat was able to get to 417 likes in the next... 431 likes in the next uh, minute or so. I, it's impossible, but there's no way chat will even get close to 440. Yes, the monumental goal of 475 likes. Is, it's a long way out there. It's a long way out there. Oh. Wow, look at that. They're harvesting the wheat. Check it out. Oh, they're harvesting the wheat. Look at that. Oh, too bad it doesn't, like, make the earth uh, soil underneath. It's all It's all grass. That's low yield, bro. Oh, and there goes the uh, the uh, mill. Oh, look at that. He stacks all the uh, sacks of uh, flour outside. Nice. And the baker just needs water. Oh, and uh, to be assigned. There we go. Yeah. And now the bread stall is being built. We'll sell direct. Fresh, like, the bread doesn't get any fresher than that in Raptoria, baby. It goes straight, straight from the uh, bakery right over to the shop. Nice. What's up, Gary? You hope I'm having a, uh, a blessed day? I certainly am. Thanks for being here. We're all having a good time. Can you come and make cakes? No, you can make lasagna. In the Bakari. I think it's Italian for bakery. Pretty sure. Okay. Well, oh, how's the church doing? Oh, we're good. Promotion available, meh. All right, it's about time to start making our, uh, oh, there we go. We're making a lot of bread now. Oh, and that's going to make us a lot of money. Oh, 
All right, let's open up a trade route to Davenport. Yeah! So now we can start importing weapons. And we'll start buying... Yeah, we'll buy ten swords. That's so cool that we're selling bread directly from the baker like that. That's cool. I think they might still need to go down to the granary to get it, but whatever. It's fine. All right, so it looks like we need to make a lot more, a lot more wheat. Hey, that's pretty good. There's about ten more sacks of flour there. But farming is always something you need more of. You said 408 likes are at 480. I think we're at 500 likes right now. I'm pretty sure. What is chat? What does that number say? Pretty sure that says 500. Okay, we'll build one more farm so we can make tons of wheat. So we basically want the, the mill to work year round. And so that means to supply with so much wheat that it can't do whatever it needs to do. Hey, we now have ten swords, which means we can go out on a military mission. Let's go. All right, help requested. Easy mission. All right, let's do it. Prepare the troops. Fully trained. Oh, and they're all fully trained, too. Fantastic. Fantastic. Success probability, impossible. How about one soldier? Low, two, average, three. I'm going to send everybody in the hopes that they get experience. There go the troops! Excellent. And of course, a successful military campaign means money! Here comes the money, money, money. Then we'll have uh, more weapons delivered. Then we can start making our own. Alright, let's go... We'll go ahead and make the iron smelter and the blacksmith after we make the uh, the last farm. Man, this... I, lo I love that. Look at... Look at how beautiful that looks. Damn. What a damn fine looking game, man. They need to make more maps. Maptoria. Oh, set the bakery to pizza rolls? Sure, let me... Okay, the bakery is set to pizza rolls now. Thanks for the reminder, chat. That was a close one. Yeah, the so the game doesn't have seasons at the moment. But it does simulate seasons by, like, wheat only being able to be planted and harvested and grows at certain times of the year, so... But I'm going to add a big O farm over here. I'm going to add a massive farm. Because we need all the wheat we can get.
Hold on. All right, so hopefully that'll be enough, enough wheat for next year. We gotta keep everybody fed. Ah, uh, what's up, Sirius Lax K? A party? Well, you, you, do you need the keys to the bus? Don't worry, no need, no need to go anywhere. Chat will be around. They'll pick you up. Anybody in chat wanna wanna pick up Sirius Lax K? We are victorious. Success chance high. Good. Or extreme. Extreme. Alright, so we'll have a lot of crops grown there next year, too. It's a much bigger field. Well, a little bigger. It's a little extra room. With all the flat land and the fertile soil. And we'll expand this one a little bit too. And this one... There we go. Little extendo. So we should hopefully have wheat year round. And we might need to build another mill, but that's fine. We've only got one bakery, so. And that's bringing us a ton of cash, brother. Amen. Okay, we should be able to expand home ownership over here. We'll buy some new territory and paint some new homes. There we go. And we'll build a church off to the side. Actually, we should... Oh, I forgot we could do hops, too, so we can do, like, ale for the inn. Yeah, there, yeah, there are different crops, like uh, hops, but it's not, like, food one. And bring our troops back. Come on back, troops. They were successful, yeah. Alright, troops are on the way. Cures what ails you? I suppose. All right, if we get 10, oh, 20 commoners and 20 splendor. Oh, let's build another church then. That'll give us splendor. And it'll also give us in, um,
desirability over here. I knew somebody was going to make the Splenda joke. I I was assuming it... Look, I was expecting Pilot Pro, but Baltimore's swooping in. Good job, boys. I'm impressed. I was just waiting. Whoa, we got a thousand gold. Holy crap. Okay, wow. We've turned this all around. Wow. Alright, we could build this now, but... Alright, let's build some rip emotes over here. For chat to enjoy. Put a couple rip emotes back here. I don't think our people are very, very tall. All right, a couple more rip emotes. Are you able to go first person and see inside the buildings? I don't think so. There could be a mod for that, but this game also has modding, so that's nice. Wow, that looks cool. I'll we'll leave that area for home building. All right, let's build. Wow, we got all this money now? Oh, it's because of the bread. The bread just brought in the billions. All right, let's get people to smelt the iron now. I might have to upgrade the military camp to hold more booty. Every time I make a city in this game, it just gets better and better every time. Wow, they're working. Excellent, now we're making iron, fantastic. Now we can start making weapons. No, no horse-drawn carts yet. Uh-oh. Bad weather is coming. My lord, there's a prediction that bad weather is coming. I recommend we stock as much food while there's good weather. Uh-oh. Well, we've stocked as much f uh, wheat as we can. We could make another well. Yeah, the, the people's eyes now blink. It is a miracle. All 
All right, so we got a lot of wheat, 89, so now we'll try to increase uh, flour production. Looks like we should make another bakery, too. <sighs> can we make the treasury bigger? We can, yep. Although I think the goal should really at this point be not to have too much money, but to spend it wisely. Well, we do have another military quest, though. Hold on. People are hungry. Uh, let's assist the king. Prepare the troops. Oh, we got some wounded here. Uh oh. Ah, uh, we'll send three and we'll do one. And everybody else will step up on their combat. Well, the real end game of this is going to be to build a, uh, like a, a tavern, doing hops farming, and then making a, a giant monastery, which maybe we could put over here or something. That'd be cool. All right, so it looks like we've made all the flour we can, and the farms are going again. Oh, can I build the dairy farm yet? Good question. I forgot all about that. Oh, yeah, we got to make a dairy farm. we got to make a brewery, a hop farm. There's the dairy farm. Maybe I should buy this territory and cut all, down all the trees? I think we should do that. And I'm going to authorize the boys to cut down all the trees. Make a big old field for dairy cows there. Okay, so we're going to make cheese, um, hops and such. Maybe we can grow over here on the side by the church. <laughs> All right, we can build some lumber camps here. That'll be a little special operation just to cut down this forest so we can start farming. Uh, dairy, dairy farming. Officional garden masterpiece. The vain efforts of your soldiers t 
to battle has inspired some of your villagers and they wish to build an official garden masterpiece to honor the occasion. Uh, optional bonus effect soldier recovery speed is increased by two. Build condition must be part of the building containing the great hall. Very well. Let's call our troops back. Oh, hi, Poglad. Wait, what do they want me to build? Oh, look at all that stuff. Cool. Oh. Garden masterpiece. Maybe I should build that onto the manor. Ooh, fancy. So we've unlocked special decorations that you can only unlock through, like, a quest. Cool. Oh, we're going to build an olive garden because when you're here, you're family. Bad weather is here. Oh, boy. <laughs> yes, LOL. Well, that's why our troops are going to heal faster, because they're going to have access to unlimited breadsticks and soup. For only $9.99? Pog. Okay, let's add the extendos onto my house. In the middle of our street. Those breadsticks are nasty and dry? No way. Those breadsticks have such artificial oil and like preservatives in them that you could literally grind them up and use them as like aircraft lubricant. The authentic Italian way, yeah. Missing resources for construction. Oh, we need tools. We got that. They just need to be delivered. The tools will get there eventually. It looks like they're building a few things. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, they don't have the Taco Bell gong. gong. That's close. Any news on Manor Lords? Well, I did put up a video at the beginning of the year, basically reminding everybody that it's coming out. I want to play it. Uh, there's some minor new news about it, but the developer is making sure that it it's perfect before they release it, which is good. Oh, 
Oh good, the lumber camps are ready. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to use the lumber camps to cut down all this forest, and then we're going to make um, dairy farms over there. So then we're going to start making cheese. I guess we could put it here. You like foundation? All right, well, make sure you smash like so I, I know you guys want to see more. I, I try to play more of what you like and what I like so we both win. We all get what we want here. That sounds like an FBI like hostage situation. Come on, we'll, we'll all get what we want here. Come on, nobody has to get hurt. Oh man, Chad, I feel I was feeling bad earlier, man. I wanted to I wish I wish yesterday when I played Strange Horticulture, I wish I, w I thought yesterday I was going to be able to play City Skylines early, but it was actually today at noon. So yesterday I waited till noon and then they were like, "Oh yeah, no, you're going to have to play tomorrow." I wish I would have played Strange Horticulture yesterday early. And I wish I would have just muted the music. I want to I wanna finish Strange Horticulture, but... We would, have, we would have finished that damn game if it wasn't for Susan. Uh, if you guys ever see me play Strange Horticulture again, make sure you watch that stream, because that game is like Papers, Please, but in medieval times, basically. Well, not medieval time. Well, yeah. Yes, but no, but yes. But no, but it is. Oh good, they're cutting down a lot of trees. Hey, don't walk through the damn, hey. You guys are walking through the damn wheat field. Don't ruin my wheat. I need that. It was a great stream. It was. That's, I'm actually, like, really annoyed. Because I want to beat that game, but I don't want to do it without you guys around. But i got to play other things. Like, maybe tomorrow I'm going to play Mon Bazoo. Because Jessica told me I had to. She threatened me. So I was like, okay. Yeah, Mon Bazoo is basically Canadian My Summer Car. You have to eat, like, poutine and literally drink maple syrup to survive. But maybe I'll do it on Monday. I don't know. I want to finish Strange Horticulture. Well, we could do another military mission. Let's see. Now our little garden's ready. Cool. So apparently that's good for the troops, I guess.
Raptor, will you play Dying Light 2? The question is, chat, will you watch Dying Light 2? Will you be there for every second of action? No. If you could put something... What, put something out of the box in this game, what would you do? I don't know what that means. If I could like build, if I could make my own building, uh, I would like it to be able to make a trade harbor. To make your own custom harbor where you can like make boats, build fishing boats, send out trade boats, have your troops go out via boat. Like you could send out your troops on a ship. That'd be cool. Will I play the new Metal War 2? Well, the real question is, will chat watch the new Metal War 2 on the channel? No. Okay. Boat. Boat. Boot. I want to make a weapons maker now. How do I do that? Ooh, we can make a gold smelter now. Oh, you have to unlock it with the Splendor Points? Okay. Yeah, I don't have it, so let's see if we got it. Oh, there it is. Thank you. Oh, we could have a Hunter? Yeah, that's for... Boar, right? That's for the Inn. Decorations for the Wooden Keep. I guess we'll get the Hunter's Hut, too. Oh, we can unlock the, the main church now. Trade bonus. Small stone wall. A message from the church. It would be an immense display of faith if you were to build a monument to our Lord's splendor. Alright, so they want us to build a big O church. I guess we could get rid of the old rustic one and build it up there. We could get rid of this church now and build a big one there. Or we could buy this land to build a big one down here. Ooh. They're getting most of those trees cleared out. Nice work. Hunting zone. Uh, we could probably do hunting up here. I don't really have a tavern, though. We'll need a brewery, a hop thingy. Okay. Maybe we'll do a hop farm up here. I like when hops are, like, grown on the side of a mountain. I think that's what we'll do. pretty nice you can build walls in the game too and section off areas 
kind of nice when you can build walls like that because if you've got like you know like for example here we've got our farms and our industrial buildings we just build like a little wall to separate them so you know which one's like agriculture the other ones that um, is uh, or production dude a lot is happening today we made we've made some great progress Troops have gone out and kicked some butt. We've unlocked uh, some masterpieces. You get rabbits to grow your hops? Uh, okay, Chad. Yep. Okay. Would be awesome to create your avatar lord and walk this... Oh, that would be cool. Yeah. Yeah, if you could actually be the lord and like of the land and walk around be kind of cool. Maybe that'll be something in the future if you get attacked. You'll have to defend it like in um, Stronghold. Oh, I forgot to assign people to the... Uh... Oh, that's alright. We don't... Oh, yeah. That's not that big of a deal. Because of the rain, we're not making much wheat anymore. It'll take a little bit longer. Luckily, we're making enough food, but wheat is slow. Oh, yeah. There I am. There's my Lord Avatar. Yes, the king in the castle. Bum, 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 bum. An envoy requests an audience. We shall assist the... Hmm... Well, the king doesn't have much more to go, so let's... Well, it's going to cost 40 for that. Oh. Um... Yeah, let's do the king then. You love this game, I know. This game's so cool because it's like there's no real... There's no real speed to it. You just do things at your own pace. Oh, there's more berries over there? Excellent. Hmm. Uh, Cheesemaker will keep closed until the dairy farms are ready. Can we build a tavern yet? Oh wait, isn't tavern a custom building you can build? Yeah, I think so. Well, let's build the weaponsmith. Can you pave roads in the new update? Not yet, but maybe in the future there will be stuff for that. I'm not sure. Okay, this can go. How much iron do we have? 151. Holy crap. Oh, we can make so much weapons. We're going to make a ton of money from weapons. Ooh, all of our 
our troops are ready to go. Except for one, but that's fine. Now, I think there's ways to get better weapons, too. Like, uh, isn't it, can't the, isn't there a way to get spears or, like, morning stars or maces or something? There's a way to do that. All right, we should build a church. And I'd like to build it here. And I'd like to build our monastery up there. Yeah, we should build a church here. Oh, we don't have money, though. Yeah, all right, well, we'll get cash when our boys come back from the military quest. Money's going to hurt now because now we're out of food. Boy, we tried our damnedest to make as much food as we could, but I guess we'll have to... Oh, well, we can't import it now either. Yeah, weapons? Yep, we're making weapons now. Well, okay, we'll, we'll get money from that. Well, actually, no, because I, I don't have enough money to build that one. We're building one. Oh, do you get the spears from quests? Okay. I know there's a way to get more weapons than swords, and then I, I think you get a blueprint, and then you can make more weapons. Like, you can only make swords at the start, and then you can find ways to make more stuff. It's kind of cool. If you make the church steeple the tallest structure, will it benefit the town? Um, I think we're going to make a roller coaster that's tall. Bro, we're going to make a roller coaster. Higher difficulty war missions? Okay, how do you get... Do you just keep doing missions and then eventually the king will give you better ones, or what? Oh, actually, wait. They all start out easy and then the more you keep going in. That's right. Each time that you keep... Like, you keep going in further and further and then it keeps grinding, yeah. Alright. Well, we'll build a church over here. This is still my private house. Fountain Sculpture Masterpiece. Building maintenance costs were decreased by 50. Build conditions, none. Ah, oh, the weather is breaking. Better days are coming. Yay! Oh, it's weird to see the rain disappear. Oh, we can build the fountain as its own thing. Oh, this is great, because then it'll increase uh, fanciness. Hmm. I guess we'll save it for a new part of town. Okay, let's build a um, dairy farm, yep. We'll start with one and see how well that works. Ooh, nope, come back. I don't want to risk dying ever again. Every time our troops go out on missions, they're getting XP, so they're getting better. Is Tan trying to poison people in the chat again by suggesting honey? You know where that comes from, right? The store. And I don't trust the store. I don't trust you, chat. All this black magic and wizardry. It's like Harry Porridge in here. And not the Poglad one either. The one from the Devil books.
<laughs> I ain't had no choco milk since 2020. Why are the the berry pickers walking all the way over there? You literally work next to the berries, bro. Have I tried it, though? No, I think the one night I was, like, tired out, I think I just fell asleep, and that was fine. No, bees are my protector. They keep me away from bears. Bees beat be bear dulcar galactico. That's how it works. All right, are we making weapons yet? Let's authorize the construction of our second weaponsmith. All right, looks like they're actually building it. Nice. All right, since we can house 12 soldiers, let's go ahead and uh, I'm assign a few more troops to the military. How do I do that? Oh, yeah. Wait. Oh, we can only assign 18. Oh. All right, we're building a big military now. We're going to have to do some big training, too. Here comes the new recruits. Okay. Are people still walking through my field? I think that was just from the previous season. Okay, let's... Uh, oh, no, dairy farm still being built. Oh, well, let's watch the construction. I love seeing... The art style in this game is just fantastic. I, I would love to see a game in ancient Japan like this, too. Feudal Japan like this would be really cool. Building boats, trading on the ocean, farming rice, hunting. What a kingdom, boys. That looks awesome. All right, now we can uh, get a dairy farmer. Oh, boy. A cool thing to do, too, is to, like, um, take those fences I showed earlier, like those stone fences, and make, like, a little paddock or whatever for the cows so they don't wander off. Alright, so now we can sell cheese. That's cool. 
And do we have enough flour? Oh yeah. If we get more villagers, then we can uh, make more bread. Oh, we can build a hops farm too now? Ah, beautiful. Good land for it. Alright, we're limited on workers, so we gotta be careful. Actually, we're not, because this job's pretty much done. Oh, they'll go back in the labor pool later. Oh, I know why the, they're coming over here to gather berries. I forgot that berries need to be marked as extraction. That's, that's why they were walking all the way over there. Raptor doesn't pay taxes? Uh, I'm not rich enough to be exempt from taxes. Maybe in a few hundred thousand more years. Okay, we could build a church, but I would like to build a, um... I want more people to get houses. Oh, we need more people, man. Just like Tucker, Raptor has priors. Yeah, like, as in prior to this stream, I was having a lot of fun in... City Skylines. Don't you sell me out, Chad. Don't you sell me out. Yeah, we gotta build a church, too. Somewhere. We could delete this church, but everybody would be mad for a while. There we go. Now we'll be making a lot more bread. And we can get a weaponsmith working. And we could redesign the military base, too, to look a little cooler. Yeah, mandatory fun. Hello from the Philippines? Hello. Hi, RJ. Ooh, they're making lots of milk. Wait. 15... Okay, now we can start making cheese. Uh, I need to sell cheese now. What's this game about? It's about 20 bucks or so.
I need 400, and 400 coin to build a market? Wow. I need to start selling uh, more bread and cheese and clothing. Forty-seven flower, nice. Well, the hops farm is working nicely. Okay, build the market. Alright, so we got plenty of berries, plenty of bread, plenty of cheese, plenty of clothing. We just need to make sure we're selling all that stuff to the people. 92% happiness. We could expand here, build the church finally. This is some pretty good flat land here. It's a little hilly, a little downhill, but it's... Better than most spots. Bueller. Bueller. Promotion available. Hmm. We need some more commoners now. Oh, we got 18 soldiers ready to go out. Nice. <clears throat> That'll allow us to stay out for a long time. Game name? Read the title in its entirety. Foundation. It's also down below the uh, name of the channel as well on the left side. Well, it's a nice game. You'll like it. A monk has requested audience. Let's see. I shall assist. We'll assist the uh, king once more, I think. Nice. Look at all that flower chat. Nice. 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 You think this game is missing werewolves? It'd be kind of cool to see if there were like mystical creatures on the map. Be an be a neat game mode where instead of having to buy the territory, you had to fight for it and clear out wolves and stuff like in uh, kingdoms and castles. Where you have to worry about wolf dens and stuff. Sometimes. Bear caves too? No. Hmm. 
No, not bears. You know, I actually think in order for us to make ale, I think we need to make a cooperage too, because I think ale needs to be put in drums as well. Let's see. Planks and iron. Okay. Now well, we'll see. I want to build the church first. That's going to take a lot of materials. Can we build castles yet? Uh, technically, yeah, I suppose. You could build a pretty cool wall. Alright, well, we have pretty much enough money to buy it. Oh good, the market is done. Vodka just needs water and potato. Are you telling me if I go out to my kitchen and I just pour a little water on a russet potato, it just becomes like Tito's handmade? Now, come on, chat. We all know it's not that easy. You have to find a bottle, too. You can't make, make vodka in foundation salad? Yeah. I think all you can do is just make ale or beer or whatever. And then a tavern. But the tavern we have to unlock. So it's like, I, I might... I, I guess I don't even need the farm working. I guess we just shut that down. For now. But we got to build for later. Because we still need a brewery and a couple other things going. How do you get the potato in the bottle? Well, anything's possible with the power of Pine Saw. Now, what you're going to need to do if you want that to work is you're going to need to get some, uh, some dial hand soap and a friend who can keep a secret. That's what you're going to need to get. Wow, we got a lot of bread. Let's start selling. Wow, that's some good cheese. We've got good cheese coming in. Yeah, everything's looking good. What? Success probability extreme. Okay, let's go. I think we're finally ready to go all in with our military and start winning victories. Why not finish vodka? I agree. Every drop. <laughs> oh, I'm supposed to deliver 50 wood to the kingdom? Uh oh. Oh. 
Bum, 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 bum. All right, I need some more logs. Um, well, the cows are in a nice spot. I wonder what, what else we should build back here. I guess I should have left some trees for hunting, but we can ask the forester to replant. But this is good for more, more food. We can just do some more farms down here. Some big love for the big channel. Amen, brother. Let's get them relax. Relax, brother. Thank you, Clinton Jones. Big O. Thank you very much, brother man. For the big O five. Thank you, dude. Them some. That's some serious nugget money at Wendy's, dude. Thank you very much. I'm uh, actually leaving now to go to Wendy's. Bye. Okay, I'm back. They were closed. All right. Ugh. Schnapps. Yeah. Keep it snappy. Can I play World War II Rebuilder? I don't know. Will chat watch me play more? Would you guys want to watch it? No. Okay. How much dairy do we have? Looks like a one-to-one -one is enough. Whoa! Wow! We just made a thousand bucks. Woo! Amen, brother. Wow. YouTuber, when is the Fortnite stream? No. What I think we could do is we could actually take these, um... We could take the sheep farm and all the tailors and stuff or whatever and, and move it all down here. So we could do all of our farming down here and then make room for all the houses up on the hill. Wow. Yeah. I, that's what I, I thought it was a good idea. Owen Wilson, thank you. Wow. All right, let's build a church. We should make it taller. Actually, taking up a lot of space there. I think we're going to build some of that stuff down here. I need to get some room. There we go. All right, we'll put sheep farms down there then. And a couple weavers huts nearby.
Bum, bum. Can we add a Wendy's to our village? We have over, I think, 133 Wendy's because that's our population. And as you all know, a Wendy's lives inside of all of our hearts. Especially if you go there often in the form of cholesterol. Amen. Alright, so let's build all that new stuff. Let's get rid of these old buildings. And let's build that church. Alright, make way. We're going to build the town bigger. I could buy up here and then build the church up here. Although the more territory that we're buying, the more we gotta pay in taxes. But I think this will be it for our town expansion. Like, yeah, we could... Oh, that's perfect for the town. That's perfect. And then we'll build the monastery up here. Beautiful. Medieval drive through run, uh, run to Wendy's. Yes. What's up, King ZZ Games? Good to see you. I'm just getting focused on building a cool church. If brothers build a church, does that make them Amen brothers? Eh, I think it makes them brother Amen. That's fine. Actually, these are bell towers. Oh, we can put that up front. Oh, that's a ta oh, this is Taco Bell. We're building a Taco Bell, and that'll let people know when we're when what day is Taco Tuesday. I always forget what day Taco Tuesday is every time. But hopefully, with that bell. We won't need any more reminders. Typically that's on Thursdays? Okay. Okay. Oh, we need a door. I guess all we get is that one. Ooh, archways. I could use this to build like a little entryway on the side and put a graveyard there or something. This church looks weird.
Well, this is going to be expensive. Well, we can build some gurgur girls. Gargoyles? That's good enough. The big O church construction begins. Oh boy. It'll look pretty over there. You're going to our Discord? All right, welcome aboard, dude. All right, so we got no wheat, but we got plenty of flour and tons of bread, so that ain't too big of a deal there, partner. Seventy-five weapons, wow. Gargoyles was a great show, I know. I can't, uh help but think of that show every time I hear the word gargoyle. Alright, so the good news is when we build the church it's probably going to increase desirability, so... Well, let's build a well over here. The next time you guys have a taco, have one for me too, your fallen taco brother. Amen, Josh's bag of tricks. Amen. You were obsessed with that show for a good while when you were younger? Yeah. Oh, we needed something to fill the gap after we got bored of like... It was kind of more of a grittier Ninja Turtles. I thought the Batman animated series was pretty uh, serious as well. Although I didn't find it interesting as a kid. Oh, I forgot to deliver the logs. Eh, we weren't making enough. That's fine. People are hungry. All right, we'll do it for the king. 20 fish, bro. God, now you're asking me to do stuff that I have to import? That's annoying. Anybody making fish? Oh, yep. Northbury sells fish. All right. The Northbury Fish 20. That show with the cats that flew the jet? I think you're thinking of uh, Lightning Felines was the name of that show. Or, by that I mean, uh, of course, Thundercats. Or you mean... Uh, uh, I forget the full name of the show. Something Samurai Pizza Cats. Teenage Mutant Samurai Pizza Cats. I have no idea. Was it just Samurai Pizza Cat? I thought it was like... Totally not feral. It's Samurai Pizza Cats. There was something beforehand. SWAT cats? I don't remember that. Batman Beyond was cool. Dude, we got so much good money. That's nice. Everybody keeps saying SWAT cats. I've never heard of that show. But we all know who our true hero is. Captain Planet.
All right, we're building the church. This is going to take three billion years. I don't know about SWAT cats. What's wrong with you? I don't know. Born at the wrong time. I don't know. SWAT cats. All right, I'm... Hold on, I'm tabbing out. SWAT cats. SWAT cats intro. Oh, wait, this looks familiar. I don't remember that being the name, though. Oh, on Warner Brothers? Hold on. Two dudes? There's just two cats? There was no lyrics or anything. Come on, man. That might be why I've forgotten it. I don't remember anything about that. Yeah, I remember how the cats look, but I don't remember anything about the show. Lyrics are expensive? Oh, come on. All you gotta do is write cat puns and talk about the night. Like, don't you know Darkwing Duck's intro? Darkwing Duck. Oh, that's probably copyrighted to hell. That's a Disney property. Oh. Even the word... Dark is probably copyrighted now. You could say duck and wing in two other sentences, but dark you can't use now. Man, we're making a great amount of food. Clothing, too? Are we not selling any clothes, though? I never see it go down. Oh wait, maybe I don't oh, I, I don't have enough people working at the shops. Now we go. And we got a great amount of flour, okay. Ah uh, yeah, I mean pretty soon Disney's not going to have to do anything. All you got to do is this, like shut down Disney World and making all Don't just don't make any more animation, shut down all your properties, shut it all down and just basically move Disney next door into like a, a small building next to a law firm and then just sue everyone for everything and that's it that's all you gotta do don't produce anything don't provide anything just own everything and then sue people for trying to use it <laughs> like that's what that's all it's gonna become like they'll be the they'll they'll make quadruple the earth's gdp in like less than, you know, 1,400 square feet office. Bro, that's what some companies do on YouTube too, you know? Like, you know, they just, they just go around and they like work they work as a third party to just flag everything as copyright and then like those companies have to pay them a percentage and it's like I don't know man. Doesn't really seem like a great use of your time. Oh promotions available. Ooh Okay. I'm promoting a lot of people. That's because we got a ton of food and stuff for them. Uh, let's see. Can you get promoted? Yep, all members are totally welcome to get promoted to Raptor Ultimate. Sure, why not? Why not promote yourself? Why not? Thumbs up emote. Okay, um, I want to... What was I going to do? Oh, yeah, I wanted to check, um, the states. 
Okay, so if we have 10 citizens, we can unlock a trade bonus. So that's what we want to go for. And then 10 monks unlock a statue and a candle workshop. Ooh, that's new. Candles, obviously. Well, I know in this game, bees make honey, but do you just trade honey as a raw resource? You must be able to trade honey and then take beeswax and make candlesticks. So there's probably two things you can make from bees. Now we need to go for 10 citizens now. Uh, promote to soldier. Ooh. We just upgraded the troops. Your army is growing stronger. We will offer you some more challenging missions from now on. Oh, ho, ho, now we get some big loot. All right. We've impressed the king, so now we'll get some more challenging missions, and thus we shall take over the world. Same thing we try to do every night, right, chat? Raptor and the chat. Raptor and the chat. Sometimes we talk about food and then cats, but only if it's what. On TV on longer, it is not. Raptor, Raptor, and the chat. Thank you. Appreciate that, chat. Thank you. Thanks, appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, let's take a look at desirability. What? Applause emote. The song is copyrighted. Am I going to YouTube jail again? Seriously, yesterday... I know I complain a lot about YouTube. I've cut back a lot. But yesterday was complete BS. I'm... I wanted to play that game, bro. I can't believe how... Ugh. If you want to know what happened, uh, just ask on the Discord. They'll do they'll do a movie night with popcorn. Someone's gonna sing it like an old medieval bard. Can you friend me in Discord? I mean, yeah, I don't. I'm really bad at Discord. Like, if you send me a DM, it'll probably it might take me a while to respond. But I I don't even know if I know how to accept friends and stuff there. But everybody's our friend if you just. Go to the chat. But you can send me a DM or whatever. And that's all good. Oh, now we can build the tavern. Sweet. Yeah, brother. Oh, now we can build the Lord's Banner out of stone. Alright, so now we can build a tavern, which means that we can now do the brewery and stuff. So that's good. So that'll probably bring our people more happiness. Damn, this is the best series we've ever gotten and done. This kingdom's just going wonderfully. We have so many weapons, too. 119? My god. Are we selling any? Oh god, let's let's not have any more than like fifteen in our inventory. I don't even think we would need fifteen. Oh, we're gonna make so much money from trade. Well you might need to expand the uh the military camp. Oh my god, this YouTuber needs to go to jail. Cops are on the way, guys, don't worry. But we'll do that after the church is done. One thing at a time. Cops are on the way.
Oh, finally. Is that is that somebody building a house? Oh, they are. Good. I thought that was part of the church. Blinky and the Prane. Okay. For copyright purposes, we gotta change the name. Makes sense, bro. Okay, so now we're gonna make a ton of money. Military missions are available. I think we should definitely do one. I don't think we got the fish yet. Did we? Nope. Sip time, yeah, sip. Yeah, that's fine. Why three churches? Well, my need for churches grew because my population grew. And sometimes it's easier to build a new church than it is to expand on an old one. And the clergy has a quest for me to build a stone church. Well, actually, the two these two churches are called rustic churches. So I needed these for our... Um, just to give people enough uh, faith or whatever they need. But... The clergy wants us to build a permanent church. And that'll complete another goal. And now we can build a tavern too, but since we're doing a big construction project, I'm gonna hold off on that. We'll build a tavern next, which means that we can build a, we can have a hops farm, a brewery, and a tavern, and then we can also have a hunter. So we should probably have a hunter go. Let's start with a hunter. And then we'll make lands for hunting back here. A lot of good land to go. I thought there used to be... I know you can find boar, but I thought there was deer in the game long ago. Amen, ramen. Oh, we're selling swords. That's good. Food is good. Cheese is a little low. Which is it. You love the videos? Well, thank you very much, Game Market. That's nice. What am I thinking about the game? I love this game. It's just gotten better and better and better and better. It takes a long time to play, even on a high speed, but it's not a game you want to rush through. And they're going to be adding more features now. Like, for example, they've made it known that they're going to be working on um, a map generator and a few other things, too, for long-term gameplay, so that's good. Uh, your trading proves a prowess has inspired some of your villagers as they wish to build an Automated found masterpiece significantly improved der uh, desirability of area. Ooh. Uh, we should probably build that over here then. Oh, pretty. Oh, that looks like it takes gold. this custom oh wow that is crazy beautiful it makes music let's just build that and then we'll add on to it oh that takes gold we don't have gold yet 
Well, we have gold as in money, but we need gold as a resource. Alright, better start sending our uh, bailiff out to prospect for gold, as in the mine. Oh, looks like we can also just gain influence with an estate by spending it, but we're good on that. Promotions available. Uh, let's do... That's fine. Uh, do you need walls for anything, or are they just aesthetic? Yeah, for the most part, they're aesthetic. Um, it, it does help you to kind of find stuff, though, if you... I mean, your city will just be one giant blob if you don't decorate. So, you know, you build, build a wall around your military camp, put walls around your sheep paddocks and your, your cow pens and stuff. I'll probably do that later. That's good stuff. Yeah, you can use them for traffic management, too. Kind of build walls around important things. Walls keep out the Mongolians only for a little bit. I want to put something up here. Actually, you know, since we can build multiple fountains like this, can I just move this thing? Oh, they already put down the foundations. So that's fine. Hopefully that gets people to move into that corner. Today is going to be the day that they're going to throw it back to you. Wow. Buy now. Extra large falafel meal for two. Nobody knows what I'm talking about. Charge! Ooh, the church is almost done. About halfway. Taco Bell. How's the UI now? Well, you can see it on the screen. I mean, it. I mean, it used to just be blue boxes and stuff, and I was okay with that. But this is just like this is really nice. It looks, yeah, it looks fantastic. Everything's really nicely organized. The game, I think the game looks a little bit more complicated than it is. Like it, this is not the type of game where you're just going to end up like failing. I think I, I played enough and failed enough to where I know it's hard to fail. You got to work to fail. Alright, tonight's goal is to finish that church. Brother Amen. We gotta finish Brother Amen Church. And then we'll uh, start building a tavern, probably. And we could probably build a tavern... Oh, back here. That's some cramped spot, but... Uh... We'll figure it out. Or up here, I don't know. We'll figure it out. What map am I playing on? Uh... Rolling Hills or something? It's one of the only maps without water. But I forget the name. So unfortunately we don't get any fish, which would be a nice food bonus, but we don't really need it. It's fine.
Ooh, his soldiers are victorious. Monk is requesting an audience. Uh, let's see, 14, labor. Ah, uh, we'll go with the, um, the people. Fifty wood again. All right, cool. We're capturing, we're killing boar. So with boar and with ale, I don't know if they serve anything else. Do they serve mead in the tavern or what? I think it's just ale and boar. Oh, maybe bread. I think you can make meals and stuff there. Yeah, I was trying to get the fish for the king by purchasing it, but I couldn't couldn't buy enough. I didn't have the granary stock set up. We should probably build another one of those then. I'll probably get rid of these now. We're gonna need to make a uh, automated farm somewhere. Not an automated farm, but a uh, uh, what would you call it? Like um, like a f well, basically just like a forest that can be regrown and then like a forestry area. Regrow a forest and then have a. Uh, have it cut down again. An Ewok village, yeah. Exactly. Man, chat, you are just so smart. Oh, we're at maximum uh, money storage. Okay. Oh, there went the money. Good. Alright, I think we're going to need to build a cooperage now so we can start building barrels for wine and for beer. I guess we'll build that down here since there's a lot of that iron being made. And then I want to build a... Brewery. Oh, I could put a brewery right here. That's a cool spot for it. Nice. Where, you, where can you, where can you make marble at? I think you can import it, or you have to go to your bailiff and then have them look for a deposit. So uh, the bailiff can go around and like test certain sites on the map for materials, and then you can go mine it. Luckily, we got lucky with this one being like we're super lucky that that was iron. 
I think marble and gold are mostly just for like really end game items. Copper, barely an hour. Yeah. Oh, Cooper, Cooper, barely an hour. Yeah. What's up, Skater 1865? Oh, the church is looking close to being done. They're just finishing up the back of the middle section now. Nice. I think we're having a resource shortage of polished stone, yeah. Let's build another stonemason hut. Do I not have one? All the stone is usually needed for bridges and uh, a couple other things. Oh, we have one back there. Ooh, difficulty is average. I'm not risking that. I want my troops to come back with super good weapons. chat you're at 700 likes thank you guys for smacking the like button welcome to all the new members tonight too by the way a lot of great people joining us thanks for all the big o super chats too and the uh lovely company as we check out foundation again i think what i'll do is we'll we will be taking a break from this again for a little bit and when spring rolls around i'll see what's new for the the 2022 update this, this update we're playing now is kind of like late 2021 um, version 1.8, but they got some big plans for the rest of the year, so I can't wait to see what they're going to be. We, we got more plans for Foundation. It's going to be coming on back. People are hungry. Do clergy. <sighs> well, the church is going to look interesting at least. I wasn't able to put a stained glass window at the front, but we'll, we can always add that later. That's another thing I like about this game too, is that you can get buildings done. Get the basic benefit from them and then improve later when you have more materials. It's nice. Nice. Uh, 
How do you keep your happiness high in late game? Uh, well, you need to focus more on luxury goods and making sure that the... Well, make sure your basic stuff is good and then focus on luxury goods. Like right here, we're getting hit mostly by a negative 5% on goods, which is not that bad. The church is almost complete. It's getting there. And now we've increased our production of polished stone. And we can have multiple bells. Wow. Yeah, we are full on money. I would... I would upgrade the manor, but everybody's busy building the church, so we kind of got to... Well, we'll just give it back to the people, call it a stimulus. Now go buy bread and cheese. That'll be fine. Go out in the bread and cheese parties. if we're going to have enough wood for that goal. Wow, this sheep farm never got built. Oh, a builder has to come over. Well, our builders are busy. And so are the citizens until they finish that church. How many videos do I have on the channel? About 7,000? Uh, let's see. I don't know if I can tell. Um... can't see. Six thousand nine hundred? Oh, wow. Well, you can see how much content I put out. All the live streams, daily videos, all the events and giveaways. Always clap that like button. Show me an A for effort, at least. Give me some good feedback on that one. I try hard. 312 million views, I think. That's, that's pretty spiffy. Alright, promotions are available. Oh, all of our soldiers can be upgraded.
Bum 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 bum. Yeah, 6.9 thousand videos. Nice. 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 Thanks for all you do. Well, thanks for being a member, dude. That's nice. It's nice to see your support, too. It's very nice. Nice. 6,000 times of me talking in a room to myself, basically. <laughs> basically. Come on, church. Build faster. Maybe we should hire more builders, but we need more workers. And apparently we have 12 unemployed, but... I try to assign them to jobs and... Okay, it is a good idea to build another builder's hut. Let's build some builder's huts down here. Oh, you need logs to do it. What's up, Zoltan? How you doing? Show you around the room where the magic happens. Oh, it's... There's, uh, four walls. Oh, it's not that interesting, really. I got a lot of stuff, uh, like, sitting around on shelves, but not anything that's, like, um... Displayable. Or nicely displayed. I'm gonna have to get some RGB lights and a big O shelf in the background and then just be like, Hey guys, welcome to my stream. I guess. I need you guys to buy my NFTs. Can you build a palace? Uh, you can build a monastery, which kind of is like a palace for Jesus. We're not producing enough logs. Recreate my place in The Sims? Eh. Do I look that creative? Come on now. Ah, Daniel, thanks for becoming a member. Welcome aboard. Member bus. Oh, another house. Okay, we're going to have them cut down a lot more of that forest so we can get some logs going. Uh, the king wants us to do military quests in 17 days, but I'm going to go ahead and hold off until we get our wounded fi uh, cured. You know, one thing I miss about this game, too, is that... Um, well, I shouldn't say I miss, but there was like some terrain that we'd build on where you, you kind of had to build like a bridge... Like, you could build a bridge and have people go across it. Like, here there's, like, a little dip. So you could put your hand up on my hip. When I dip, you dip, we dip. Or no, I mean, uh, you could build a bridge across the uh, ravine. Across the dip. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Ooh, the tavern wall looks nice. You could actually use the tavern wall to build that around uh, your lord's manor. And that would look really nice. A little privacy wall. Uh, 
Uh, well, that's... Wow. That's not what I wanted at all. How the hell with that? Anyway. Uh, King ZZ, thanks for being here, dude. Alright, so now we're going to hire some more builders and the church will get done even faster. So everybody from here on out becomes a builder. Keep in mind, too, the bigger you make your structures, the longer they take to build, obviously. More resources are required, too, so you gotta have a big old production chain to support it. Name them all Bob. The Builder or the Ross? Bob the Ross or Bob the Builder? Can we do it? Oh, you bet we sure can. Because I believe in you. Yes, I do, chat. I'm Bob Bobbert, Bobbert Rossley. I'm getting excited to see what Pinto and what Bradford will do in uh, City Skylines for the airport DLC. Honestly, I thought when I played that earlier today, man, I thought that was going to go like like that. I thought we were going to be turboed, but I was, I was quite happy that it was actually a little slower. It's nice that it's slow. Even in the fast speed, it was like, you need thousands, hundreds of thousands of dollars. In retrospect, I should have probably built on one of the old cities, but I don't know. We got three new maps, so that's nice. Church is getting there. Okay, so brew just to make uh, beer. Oh, it's beer. Okay. Just one wheat, one hop, water, and beer. Oh, that makes beer, yeah. Yes, of course. One beer equals one beer. And one long weekend. Hey, man, brother. Okay, that'll take a minute. We need more polished stone. What's up, Grimway? Oh, Grimwise, how you doing, dude? Going good for me, yes. Thank you. Muy bueno. Si. Bum, 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 bum.
Okay, so we got more people making polished stone, and we got more people building. Now the good thing is, too, is as big as we build this church, it'll be able to accommodate a lot of people. So when they upgrade their houses and when we build the city, we won't have to worry about the church being too small. Bum, bum. Thanks for the member pickup from my party. I appreciate it. Yep. Chat's going to have to bring the member bus in for an oil change, by the way. So if anybody wants to hop in the member's bus and park it over at the uh, maintenance bay for the, for the night, we'll have uh, Harry get to it in the morning. That boy knows his way around an engine. Oh, by the way, uh, Gas Station Simulator's uh, Car Wash DLC, or update, I should say, comes out on the 27th. So, since they promised us early access to that, we're probably going to be able to take a look at that maybe next week, question mark. Maybe? Yeah, Poglad. Poglad will drive that little big old bus over to the fun zone. All right, how much work has to be done? Oh, not much. They're getting the rest of the polished stone over. And then a little bit of the regular stone. We just need more builders, that's all. Can I assign more workers? Oh yeah, prioritize construction, good. Oh, I can hear... Is that an archer? Sound like an archer firing off arrows. Oh man, this city is great, man. The only thing we're short on is polished stone, but I've always noticed that when you build these big projects like this, it's all it's almost impossible to supply enough stone. Like, we got people making polished stone right away, and it's just not enough. Are they mining crypto? Oh, yeah, they are. The puffs of smoke in those tents is somebody hitting the uh, GPU with a fire extinguisher. chat you know what we should do no never mind I was gonna say well no I would tomorrow I'm debating on playing either Mon Bazoo maybe this again or maybe all right. Long story short, I want to play. Long, I want to play. Uh, I want to play Strange Horticulture again, but my schedule's busy, and the whole YouTube algorithm is borked and stuff. So that way, if I schedule another stream, no, none of you guys will get the notification. So maybe tomorrow night we could plan a super super secret stream, where tomorrow night I play Mon Bazoo, or maybe I play this again or whatever, and then after that, I say, "Hey, secret stream," and then I. Then we finish up Strange Order Cult. Nah, I shouldn't do that, because there's probably people who want to see it. And they won't know that I did it. If I, if I do Strange Order Cult at the end of some other stream, and people want to see the end of that... Damn you, Susan. I can't believe that. That sucked. I'm still mad. All right, I'm over it. Okay, um... Is the church done? Oh my god. 
The church just needs the materials that are on the left. It needs about 10 more stone. About, t uh, well, a little bit of polished stone. Oh, that's it. And then like one tool. Oh my god, wait, people are already attending the church? Wait, there's already six people going to the church? Oh, people are like super early. F the algorithm, do what you want. Well, I can't because if I do do that, no one, no one will get the notification that I'm actually doing anything. So it's like, what's, you know, it's like, it's like having a dispute with the city and being like, hey, you can, hey, you can have your store open anytime you want, but no one's going to know you're open because we're going to block all the roads. You can be open, but you're not going to get any customers in your shop with the roads blocked. That's how it works. I can put it in the title, but the, the problem is this. Tomorrow I'm going to put up a video. YouTube only allows me to... only YouTubers only get four notifications a day. We only get to tell you that we made things four times a day. So technically I already get five, so a lot of people don't get notifications because... If I do a live stream, that's one notification. If I do another live stream, that's two notifications. If I make those streams VODs so you guys can watch them after the stream, that's two more notifications. That's four for the two other live streams that are now videos. And then if I put up a video, that's another one, so that's five. So technically it's hurting my... Making content on YouTube is actually hurting my channel. <laughs> So if, if you want to be, if you guys want to become big on YouTube, all you got to do is just get big on Twitch. Then Susan will have uh, Ryan, what's his name, fly over and uh, cut you a check, and then you can start streaming on YouTube, and then get banned on your second day by playing Baby Shark. I need more channels. I think you're right. Well, this year, this year I've got some plans working. I, I'm working on some stuff in the background. I'm not going to say anything about when, but soon. All right, the church is almost done. Let's get back to this game. Let's finish up strong, boys. The church is now being fully constructed, just missing a few more materials. And there are five builders assigned to its construction. That's fantastic. When you have multiple channels, then you can channel them to the main channel. Yeah, but then, like... I don't know. It's just like, they don't want you guys to have power. That's why they took away the dislike button. They don't want you guys to have power, which is why they control what you see when uh, notifications go out. And it's like, why not... Why not give you guys the power? If a channel starts to suck, you unsub. If you love a channel, you subscribe. If you really, really like a channel, you go there every day. Even if they didn't make a video and you just go there to check. Like, that's how it goes. Do a VOD channel? Yeah, but no. To do a VOD, uh, maybe. Well, VOD channels, people do that for Twitch, but I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out. This year is going to be the year I figure it out. Maybe. Why right, the church is almost done. Pinto bless. I like how the church is kind of tucked into the forest a little bit. It's kind of nice. It looks more like a castle. You'd love to see me on Twitch more. You guys keep asking about Twitch, so maybe I'll do... That's going to be weird as hell, but maybe I'll do a Twitch stream. It's been a long time. I don't understand why you should be so restricted in actual content creation. It's bizarre to me. Because they don't want you watching stuff that they don't make a lot of money on. So they want you watching Mr. Beast and Roblox, so that way they make the most amount of money from ads or whatever. And then scream trust and safety whenever they make a change, like the dislike button. Oh, dude, YouTube's been YouTube's had this rating system forever, 
And we just found out that people might dislike to be mean. So here at Corporation, trust us with your say. Okay, I'm not, I'm not going down the same spiel again, damn it, chat. You baited me. Stop it. Stop it, chat. Stop it. Be nice. I blame you for me. You're supposed to have me under control, chat. That's what you're supposed to do. You've been following for a while of the, ch the content? Yeah. Well, listen, if I ever stop streaming here as much or don't upload as many videos, this is still like the main, the main thing, the flagship. But I think it would be smart at this point to have different vehicles in the fleet, you know? A semi-truck shouldn't always deliver everything. Sometimes you got to have a little delivery van or a little postal truck. Or if you think about it in terms of a, <coughs> a naval fleet, this is the main... Uh, this is like the aircraft carrier, so it's a good idea to have like a destroyer, a couple frigates, a sub, maybe a hoagie, maybe maybe a burrito. No, no, now I'm thinking about food. I mean, um, you know, yeah, we gotta have uh, patrol boats and other stuff. You know, for all all sorts of, uh, you know, gotta fit every job. All right, the church is almost done. We're at, uh, boy, this looks like 89% or more. Six parts are currently under kids. Oh my god. Wow. There's so many people working on this pro... Each section of the building has somebody working on it. That's crazy. I don't think I've seen this level of construction before. Where people are doing this much work. We're going to need all these... So for as long as this took, by the way, multiple years... The monastery is probably like the biggest thing. The biggest thing that you can make. Noble Fates, yeah, I keep hearing about that. Maybe I'll I'll check I'll check out that one. And then Jessica B was playing an interesting one the other day where um something else. Is there a wheelbarrow inside the church? Oh, okay, well, too late for that. Well, I guess there was, yep. The Church of Pinto Blast is almost complete. Wasn't that a cathedral? Yeah, I mean, this is basically like a church cathedral. A ca church. It's a good church. Ca church. Also, I think before you construct it, you can actually um, change the color of the roof and stuff. I forgot about that until just now, but a lot of these buildings, you could change their appearance of their, like, the roof tile color and the stone color and stuff like that. Oh, come on. The church has got to be done now. Oh, yeah. There goes the gargoyle. This church looks like the first one you built. What, this one? Mm, um, they all look pretty different, I think. This one looks thick. Gem encrusted cross masterpiece. Wow. Oh, the church is open now. Fantastic. A new member. Welcome. A new member. Fantastic. Preston, thanks for becoming a raptor egg. Welcome aboard. Yeah, let's go for... Um... Oh, we'll go with labor. Oh, here we go. A difficult mission. Okay, so now we can go on a difficult mission. Okay, the difficult mission is going to give us a lot of loot. Or at least really good loot. But not the first raid, like usually the second. Man, our people made 55 swords. Holy crap. 
All right, there they go. There goes the troops. Wow, the church is done. Oh, wow, we can take 111 people in there. Nice. That's almost the whole population. All right, last thing is to... Check out what that other masterpiece was. I think these are new. Oh, we can add it on there to modify an existing. Okay. Well, all right. Okay, so to finish the automated mountain, we need marble scul marble sculptures, and then that's it. So, And probably gold and some other stuff, but that's all. Something we'll have to do in the future. All right, folks, that's my time for Foundation. This game is stellar, man. We're going to come back and do a series on this one in the spring, so make sure you subscribe and turn on the notification bell. I might come back and do one more stream on this in this world on this map before we uh, start a new series. Uh, but it'll all be based on the developer's updates. So uh, make sure you follow the channel and subscribe and uh, follow on Twitter and uh, Discord. Ah, exclamation point Twitter. I barely got any new Twitter followers. I keep forgetting to like pump that one out. So uh, follow me on Discord, Instagram, Twitter. Come say hello. And I will see you guys tomorrow for City Skylines in the AM. We'll continue to build a modern city with the airport DLC early before that comes out on Tuesday. And then also, um, I don't know what we'll do in the PM. It'll probably be Mon Bazoo, but maybe it will be Foundation again. We'll see. Depends. All right, guys. Have a good afternoon, good evening, good night. Thank you very much for your time, all your support, all the big O Super Chats, memberships. And uh, enjoy the rest of your weekend. If I don't see you, stay out of trouble. Otherwise, uh, Tan and Jessica B. will find you. And uh, you don't want them to find you. Goodbye.